Welcome back everyone. Storm Track 5 meteorologist Aaron Little tracking another kind of gross day. We really need this weekend. <laughs> There's no sugar coating it. Yes, it's not going to be pleasant for today unless you want to stay inside. If you've got work to do at home indoors, if you want to have an indoor day with the kids, then today's going to be fantastic. For everyone else, it's just going to be very wet. It's going to be kind of noisy, and we do have the flooding concerns across our area. Today is a Storm Track 5 weather alert day. We're already kicking it off this morning with scattered showers across our area. Most of these over northern Missouri, extending through areas of Highway 36. But what I'm keeping a close eye on here on Live Power Doppler, just a couple of isolated storms now trying to get going here near Liberty. A few more on the west side of town to the west of Bonner through DeSoto and Lawrence. Would not be surprised if this just fills right on in over Kansas City over the next half hour. I have a 50% chance of rain here for the short term over the next couple of hours, but then look at these chances going uphill. I think almost all of our viewing area will see showers and thunderstorms heading into this afternoon with an 80% chance of rain on the way, and we will still see unsettled conditions, I think, as we're moving into your evening plans for tonight. So here is the newest update of our Storm Track 5 forecast track just to help show you where this rain is expected as we're heading into this afternoon. And this is a look at the lunch hour where we have little bits and pieces this morning. I think it will blossom and become widespread this afternoon. And then I do expect that some of this rain is going to be heavier with some of these heavier downpours here in Kansas City as we're heading into this afternoon. Just not a great day to run errands in terms of trying to get home. If you are working um, at your workplace today, trying to get home for your work uh, commute could certainly be slow going as we're heading towards tonight. I'll look at six o'clock this evening. Gary Amber will likely still have scattered thunderstorms on the radar as we're heading into this evening. Now the one concern with the thunderstorms that we're going to see here for the next 12 to say 16 hours flooding concerns an additional one to even three inches of rain for some of us just today with the storm system moving through our area. The good news by tomorrow the sunshine is back and it is going to be fabulous here as we are moving towards our Friday moving into the weekend. Look at these lower 70s less humidity as well, but I have added a 20% chance of rain in the forecast now for the weekend. Gina, over to you. All right, thanks, Erin.